back now, also new at five o'clock tonight. After spending about a year in recovery from a traumatic car crash, a Shafter police officer is gearing up to go back to work. 17's Marco Torres joining us now in studio with more on that story. Marco. Jim, Matthew Sanchez was hit by a car in January while directing traffic after a car crash. His leg was crushed and he's been on leave ever since. And now he's ready to come back. Shafter police officer Matthew Sanchez had his leg crushed during a car crash in January. This happened a day after his 28th birthday. I don't know if I heard the loud brakes squeal or I just heard the car coming. It caught my right leg in between her car and my trunk. Sanchez says he still thinks about the moment everything sunk in. Uh, I remember laying there for a couple seconds thinking like, oh, I made the jump. Uh, I looked down at my leg and uh, blood was everywhere. My foot was facing the wrong way. Initially, I thought that, that my accident would be the worst part of it all. Uh, but once I, once I got done with all the surgeries and got out of the hospital, that's when life kind of kind of hit me hard. Sanchez was the sole income for his family, including a three-month-old baby boy. Things looked grim until the Kern County 999 Foundation stepped in. I, I never thought this was going to happen to me. For me, it was like I had never been through this. I had no idea who to talk to. And they came in and sat down with me and, hey, whatever you need, we got you, you know. The foundation gave more than just money. They gave him friends and a life coach to help him through this trial. We're able to help the survivors, the injured officers, by the community support. I'm almost able to run. I'm getting close to it. And I should be back to work in November. I'm scared for the future, but I think I'm just going to jump back on it and hopefully just hit the ground running. Now, Sanchez says he's got through this trial because of what he believes was one of the worst moments in his life, only because of the support, love, and generosity from his family, partner, and the 99 Foundation gave him. In studio, Marco Torres, 17 News.